Hi guys and welcome back. So I have shown you my Lindstrom, my African Pride. So now this is my Gaffner. And just look at this frame here. So as you can see, it has a lot of fruits. <laughs> so from this frame alone, you can see that there may be what? 4, 7, 11, 12 or 13 fruits here. So, uh, you know, on two sub branches, you know, so just, you know, just one sub branch and uh, two sub branches. So as you can see, <laughs> over set in this year so i'm you know i got a little bit too excited a little bit too comfortable and the result well the fruits are still very small <laughs> so so i should have thin out you know maybe you know maybe a few you know five or six fruits at the beginning of the season so that this guy can be a little bit further along right now but you know it's not but it is what it is so it is fine um so this is uh the gaffner uh actually my favorite uh the way it looks um, so this guy is, you know, is getting there, maybe halfway there, uh, maybe uh, a quarter of a pound. Um, this guy here is the most uh, further along. And just look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Right? The color is great. Here's another one. Small still, but the shape is very even. Um, so that's one thing. Uh, another one here, very even. So imagine, the, the, you know, this guy here. You know open all the way up maybe this big to a pound pound and a half that's going to be quite a sight um so here are some more so this this little branch here so this branch here is what maybe about a centimeter in diameter and look at this <laughs> i have four fruits set on this branch and that is way too much maybe i should have had maybe two and then if that's the case then you know it may it may have gotten this big already and be a little bit more uniform as well because look at this look at the shape isn't that a nice fruit um so this is the third or maybe the third or the fourth year i, I can't remember but um uh this tree has been with me for you know quite some time since i first started this uh this garden um so and it, it's getting there so the fruits are now well um developed uh the shape is very very nice and look at this guy here this look at that beautiful right <laughs> but overall too many fruits so right now it, it is the mid of december uh the goal is to get these guys to be ready by lunar new year and usually that is you know at the end of january or uh early february um so still a month and a half left and some of these guys here um you know these two here may not make it <laughs> then but we do have a month and a half and the tree tends to to speed things up a little bit towards the end of the season so hopefully it will get somewhere um so it can be ready for the uh, for the new year um that's when you know you know you give these as gifts uh and then you can sell them as well because these guys are quite expensive uh during that time it may go up to about 25 26 dollars a pound and where i used to uh, to live in the midwest minnesota these guys can go up to 30 dollars a pound and you know and and they don't even have them to sell uh, because these don't grow there and it has to be shipped there and uh usually the fruits get get there from you know hawaii florida um, but they don't have these guys they have uh, the sugar apple so you know so that is something that is a market that i may be looking at because i do have family there um and then i can just send this there and they can just you know take order from facebook <laughs> and uh and use that money to buy more trees <laughs> but let's look at it beautiful right so this is the this is the gaffner isn't that isn't that something beautiful so this is my favorite of all of all the varieties that i have here in my yard so far um so these uh, the meat is chewy um the sweetness is a little bit behind the african pride but it's just right for me um so here this <laughs> this is actually I don't know what it is um this is a, a grafted branch um so this was supposed to be ppc but obviously it is not by looking at it not not even close <laughs> but uh this is a graft uh grafted branch um it was grafted this season so there's the joint and as you can see i already i already have fruits for the first season so that is the beauty of grafting really um so with this tree here uh, if you have limited space like I do, a small tree like this, you can graft as many varieties as you want. You know, 5, 10, 15, or 20 even, as long as you have, you know, branches to graft it on. So you, or even if you don't have branches, you can graft 
and you know one variety and then another variety on top of that branch you know and just keep going <laughs> and then and you're gonna have a bunch of different varieties you know to to try every single season and that is exactly what i will be doing um this coming season you know buy maybe three to four different varieties and graft it onto my tree and then try more varieties so that is the beauty of atamoyas you can graft you can cheat <laughs> but just look at that beautiful right i am so excited for the for, for, for these guys here to you know to fully uh, you know grown uh you know get to its maximum size but uh but i think this year a lot of the fruits here are not going to get to its maximum potential because i just you know there's just too many i said way too many you know i i got a little bit too comfortable with my tree and uh you know just <laughs> just let it go and just pollinate and uh and once it's set it's gonna stay <laughs> so you know but so you know but if you want to do it the right way you know Make sure that you thin out your fruit so that, you know, to the amount that your tree can handle so that the fruits can get to its, you know, maximum potential and, you know, it look good. <laughs> Man, but just look at that. Look, just look at how even that fruit right there is. Beautiful, right? I can't wait. <laughs> but for me, uh, so hopefully they, these guys here can get ready by, uh, by the Lunar New Year. But, you know, if it doesn't, that's fine as well. Um, I do have other trees that... Uh, that are should be able to to, to get uh, to get to, uh, to be ready by then. Uh, so for me, this is my tree. So you know, whenever it wants to to be ready to consume, I'll eat it. <laughs> I don't mind waiting. <laughs> All right, guys, just an overview of my Gaffner. Uh, hope you guys like it. Uh, if you like to stay up to date with me and my tree, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you and have a great day.